Okay, so here are my three steps. Number one, mobilize and stretch. Two, activate your natural built in back support. And three, retrain and reset years of bad back habits. So mobilizing and stretching. If you've seen a cat or watched your wildlife program, you'll understand that cats love and need to stretch. And they do this to get their muscles moving again after periods of inactivity, whether they've been sitting still or sleeping. And this is a necessity for them to survive in the wild, to be able to be agile, catch food, jump away from danger, etc. They've got to move to get on with their everyday activities. And the concept is the same for us. We need to move. Our body features a fascia membrane which surrounds our muscles and is like several layers of cling film. If we do not move regularly, the fascia gets tighter and tighter, thicker and thicker and we become more and more stiff. In addition to the above, the muscles become shorter and tighter from reduced movement. And if we don't stretch our muscles, this can lead to injuries from everyday movements, such as reaching to put your socks on, making your bed, or just as simple as getting up and down from a chair. So moving regularly and stretching is most important to your everyday life. Stretching helps to elongate the tight muscles. However, this is only part one of the jigsaw. You also need to strengthen the core. For years I did yoga and it was helpful for my back. But after studying to become a yoga teacher, I realised there was something else missing. And that was I also needed to tone and strengthen the core muscles by using low impact floor pilates based floor based pilates exercise but of course i couldn't do sit-ups and i couldn't do crutches because they put strain on my back and neck so what is this core the core plays a huge role in supporting the back just imagine a tree the trees have a strong root structure so they can withstand heavy winds and stand and stand still whilst those winds are coming they stay standing our core muscles are an essential part of keeping the body and the back supported, just like the roots of the tree. When the core is strong, it reduces the risk of your back suddenly going out of place. And the core muscles are used in so many daily movements, such as getting out of bed, walking down the street, bending to pick up children, everything you can possibly think of. Moving is king. So let me know in the comments, do you think you move enough or <laughs> do you sit down too much? Which one are you? Are you, are you a corporate for <laughs> sitting down too much? It might be at a desk, it might be at home. Let me know. Okay, and number three, retrain and reset years of bad back habits. So I began to watch how I held my posture in everyday activities. I learned how to reduce my anxiety and stress that was caused by the pain and even in aggravated the pain even further. Okay, so let's review what we've talked about. So importance of mobilising and stretching, moving every day, stretching out those tight muscles, toning and strengthening the core of the body, so it acts like a corset around the body. We're talking about the roots of the tree, nice supported structure there. And retraining and reset years of bad back habits. So if you're used to rounding through your shoulders, not moving a lot, you need to address those. Or maybe there's something you're doing repetitive, which isn't good for your back. Which is often, I think you get lots of golfers, uh, you know, swinging from the same side all the time. And that muscle on usually the right side, which most people are right-handed, gets overused. So what are you doing to any repetitive things that you're doing that could be causing your back issues as well? I am honoured to share this opportunity with you because the best way I can help you is by personally supporting each of you. So I've set aside time over the next couple of days to speak to you personally about how I can support you and to apply what we've talked about today so that you can be begin, <laughs> begin to reduce your back issues 
within 28 days. I do that with a call called Improve Your Back Lower Pain, Improve Your Back Pain Call. And this calls for you if you've got general lower back pain, herniated disc, sciatica, scoliosis, spondylolisthesis, osteoarthritis, or just general backache. And if you want to have some floor-based exercises and techniques to help reduce your back pain. It's for you if you're ready to commit to following a step-by-step -step system, even when life gets rocky. Don't worry, you'll get support. So you hopefully won't fall off that horse. If you're tired of trying one thing after another and want to know how to support your body so you can stop feeling aching, sore and your back spasming, then this is for you. It's also for you if you want to stay as active as possible and try to continue with your daily activities. And if you value your body enough to prioritise it for 28 days. So I'm honoured to share this opportunity. So all you need to do if you want to book a call, you go to the link that I've popped in here. I will put it in the comments below. You pick your day click on the button what time you would like add your telephone number in then i will give you a call and we can have that call or um, at that time which you've decided to pick and what else did i want to say let me see i put some notes here make sure i've covered everything Okay, yeah, so on this call, we'll be able to go through um, a couple of questions. Um, and the call is free, by the way. So I'm not the only one in the Pilates or fitness industry. There are so many people out there doing that, which is absolutely great. However, I am the best at working with individuals with lower back issues who want to reduce their issues without solely relying on body workers. I transformed my own life and my client's life. So here's what to do next. I'll put the link in the comments and you can book a call with me. Here it is. So now you've seen how to schedule that call. I want to go over a couple of specifics on the call to help you discover a simple and effective way to get in a little bit of freedom from your bank issues. So on the call, we'll get clear on your specific goal, why you want it, any obstacles and challenges that might derail your success, and any self-sabotage that is happening. By the time the call is over, you'll leave with helpful recommendations that propel your success. And if I think you're a right candidate for my 28-day programme, we can also talk about that as well. Oh, and that's the end. I didn't finish my last slide. <laughs> I forgot to put it in. So thank you so much. If you've got any questions for me, please do ask me. Um, I'd love to know. And if you want to book a call, there is a link again. I'll put it in the comments. And thank you for your time for watching. I hope you have a great rest of the day. Thank you once again. And goodbye.